Your organization has several employees who have been working for many years. You want to determine if employees' productivity changes with the number of years or months they spend in the organization. You are given the data, create a scatter plot and select the correct option from the given choices. Let's analyze the scatter plot. You will find that as the tenure of the employees increase, their productivity is showing a lowering trend. Hi, welcome to this episode of the practical applications of 7 basic tools of quality. My name is Rahul Ayer. In the previous episode, you had gone through the real life example of the scattered diagram. In today's episode, we will discuss another real life example of this same tool. Why wait? Let's begin. Let's look at the example. I have provided a downloadable link to this data in a spreadsheet in the description section. Please feel free to download this spreadsheet and follow along this activity with me. Your organization has several employees who have been working for many years. You want to determine if employees' productivity changes with the number of years or months they spend in the organization. You are given the data. Create a scatter plot and select the correct option from the given choices. We will look at the given options a little later. Let's take a quick moment to create the scatter plot. Here we go. This is the scatter plot. Let's analyze the scatter plot. You will find that as the tenure of the employees increase, their productivity is showing a lowering trend. So, the appropriate statement that will be correct is as the tenure increases, the productivity percentage decreases. Thus, based on the scatter diagram, the correct answer is option 3. And that's it. You have used a scatter diagram to infer the results of a real life problem. We've come to the end of this episode. In the next episode, we will discuss the practical applications of another tool, the control chart. If you have liked this episode, hit the like, share and subscribe button. And don't forget to add your comments. See you in the next episode.